Um, I'm gonna give y'all a quick outfit of the day what I wore out to eat. I ran errands. I did a lot today. Doctor's appointment, ran errands, and went to Red Lobster. So, um, and as y'all see, it's a Eloquy haul. My first time shopping at Eloquy. Before we get to that, I'm just gonna do the um, outfit of the day. It was gonna be a separate video, but I don't feel like it. So, we're gonna start off with my earrings. Earrings, y'all know these are the ones that my mom gave me. These are the blue ones. And backpack betsy johnson this was a birthday gift bracelet this was a gift no rings today and i have on the um infinity bracelet from payless that can turn into a necklace and an anklet as well i'm gonna just put my backpack there hope it don't fall it though um i'm gonna pan the camera down so i have on this boohoo dress that i hate how they made this part as y'all know that was in the boohoo all y'all already know i did a whole little rant about that so this is the dress and i just have one of my sandals from payless this dress is very, very short. Ooh, I'm about to fall, y'all. I'm stepping on the cords. I don't think y'all can see my sandals. But I'm about to take them off anyway, because my feet hurt. Alright, I don't want to step on these cords, but these sandals are from Payless. And this dress is from Boohoo. But these are the sandals, y'all know I got them in all colors. Alright, we're going to get started with the Eloquy Hall. First time shopping at Eloquy. I always want to shop with them. They're so expensive, but I got a good deal on these swimsuits. So I just got two swimsuits for y'all. Two bikinis. So let's open her up. Eloquy is more like an elegant. <laughs> it's more elegant. Like it's really um, conservative um, businesswoman. Their um, stuff. But I mean, they had some party stuff too, but they're more business attire to me. That's my opinion. So first is these, I believe these are the bottoms. So I didn't know whether to get a 16 or I didn't know whether to get an 18. So I looked at a haul and someone was smaller than me. She got an 18. So she said she always get um, an 18 in the bottoms, a 16 in the top. Because her top is small, but y'all know my top is big, so I would need an 18 and both. So she was getting 18, I knew not to get the 16. I was like, let me get an 18. Yeah, and I'm glad I did, because I can tell these look like they're small. They look small. So I'm glad I did get the 18. A lot of people say Eloquie run big. So this is the 18, this is the bottom. They're just the fruit bottom. Y'all know I love stuff with fruit on them. Fruit bottom. And I'm snagging it because of my nails. Um, so it don't have the price or anything. So I'll tell y'all the original price and how much I paid for it as soon as I get to that. But do we have the size at least? So this is the 18. You can see the size. I just took my polish off my nose. So these are the bottoms. Let's see how they fit because they look like they're going to be snug. It will be a try on. And this is the top. I hope the top fit because if the bottom's fitting, looking like it's going to fit tight. And these are final cells, though. So I won't be able to send it back. It'll be going on my site, if anything. And this is the top. Oh, looking small. I don't know. This is the top. And I do like um, um, Sarah Vargas. Sarah, Sarah Vargas, I think that's how you pronounce her name. She is the one that had, she had the green one like this. And I think she had the whole, because this come in a one piece too. I think she had the one piece like this. And she was saying how she liked the back. That is just one back all around and it don't snap. And I like that as well. It has the back all around. And you can wear strapless and it do come with the straps. I will be putting the straps on. I might as well do that now. But I'm going to just wait to the try on. But I'll show you all both ways. So this is how it looks. And the top is an 18 as well. It does have underwire and it does have boning on the side, which I love. And I love hit the underwire. And I love how it got that corset. It kind of reminds me like, a, it's not a corset look, but the top do look like the bust. It looks like a corset type thingy thingy. This is an 18. Uh, I hate doing this because the lighting changed when I do that. Next one, and these are two baby suits that I wanted since they had them, but I wasn't paying that money for them. So, 
Call me cheap if you want, but I wait for a deal because I have so many swimsuits anyway. It's not like I needed it right then and there. So this can be for next year or it can be for, I got trips coming up. So far, I don't went to Mexico. Next week, I leave for New Orleans. So y'all will see those vlogs and stuff. Y'all definitely see Mexico. I already got those scheduled. NOLA, y'all will definitely see that because I will definitely vlog and stuff for NOLA. Um, it's going to be NOLA in Mississippi. My friend lives in Mississippi. But you have to fly into NOLA or um, Atlanta to get to Mississippi. So I'm going to fly into NOLA and it's a two-hour drive to Mississippi to her house. But we're going to stay in a hotel in NOLA and party in NOLA for um, Labor Day weekend. Then we're going to go to her house in Mississippi. And it's my first time going to my friend's house since she moved. First she moved to Atlanta and then she moved to Mississippi. She's been trying for the longest to get me to Atlanta and I end up not ever going um, until she moved. And then... Now she's trying to get me to come here. And she comes to Philly. It's not like she comes just to see me. Because um, her, her daughter, father live here. And she got her mom here and stuff. But whenever she comes to Philly, she makes sure that she comes see me. And we party and we hang out. So it's only right to go see my girl. Shout out to my... I was about to say my cousin. Shout out to my friend Crystal. Um, I'm finally going to her house in Mississippi. She's been trying for the longest. So it's only right. And now I think I'll be going a lot but the only reason why i never wanted to go because i never flew on i never flew or flown by myself um is always with someone i mean i'll meet the person at the airport and we fly together but i never flown by myself is it flew or flown i've never flew by myself however i never flew by myself i never flown by myself y'all tell me flown flew i never um <laughs> flew by myself so this would be a first. It's only a two and a half hour flight or two hour flight, but still I'll be by myself. And I know kids fly by themselves, her child fly by herself. So, you know, so I go on rant. So, I mean, that's not a rant, but I go off on tangents. Who I used to watch, she used to always say that she go off on tangents and I do the same thing. I think all us YouTubers, we want to tell our subscribers so much that we try to get everything in. And a lot of people don't like that. They like stick to what we're coming to see. So, I'm trying, y'all. But it's like I be wanting to tell y'all so much. And I might be going to Puerto Rico September. I'm still deciding if I'm going to go. I was invited, but I'll be an add-on. So, I don't know if I'm going. And I already paid for Bermuda. We're going to Bermuda in October. So, I got a lot of trips coming up. So, these one weird swimsuits will get done. So, this one was my most all-time favorite that I wanted the first person I saw with this one is what is her name I watch her all the time um I forgot but she be popping I cannot think of that lady name it's on Instagram she's on Instagram she's a plus size model and I cannot think of her name I hate that but these are the bottoms I'm so glad I got the 18 and not the 16 because these look small so I just thought these were so cute I think um, um, Jessica Torres, I think she got these too. She's a YouTuber as well. I think I saw her with these. I'm snagging it because of my nails. But I got a really good deal on these swimsuits. So cute. Tell me this is not too freaking kill. I'm looking at what cover up I got to match it. So cute. So cute. So many colors. So many cover ups you can wear with it. So cute. I got to clip my nails or something. So cute. But y'all will see more of that in a try on. And these are 18. They look small. I know that they're going to be tight. I can just tell. It just seems like it's going to be tight. So now I know that they do, LLP do not run big. I guess it depends on what you're getting. So this is how the top look. I wonder if the top is like that one. Do a buckle or yeah, this one do have the buckle on the back. So it's not like that one. So this one have the buckle in the back. But this is how the front look. I thought this was so cute. This one do look bigger in the cup, so. I cannot wait to try this stuff on. So this is how the front look. And it's like, it's, oh, I thought it was asymmetrical. I gotta tie it. So you can tie it as tight or as loose as you want. That's the good thing about it. I probably can knot it too if I wanted to. Let me see. Should I knot it, y'all? Yeah, I'm gonna knot it. That's, I'm sure that's probably how it was. So how it look. And this is how the back look. So I'll let y'all see how it look with the straps and without the straps. So y'all can see if y'all boobs, I wear a 42, um, 
Now I'm trying to see. I guess it all depends. I'm using a 42D or a 42 double D. I like to get 42 double Ds or a 44 D. But for me, I think a 42 double D would be good. Now, depending if it's like a cheaper place like Rainbow, I'll get a 44 day. Um, 18, but 42 double day at Lane Bryan or somewhere. One time I had to get a 40 triple day, I believe, at Lane Bryan. I think it was like a 40 triple day. Yeah. It all depends. But if it's like Ross or Rainbow or something, it's going to be like a 44 day. Alright, so let's get to the trial, y'all. So, if y'all like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel if you Oh, I know y'all probably like, if you don't tell us how much you pay for it. Alright, y'all, so, it was called the, the fruit one is called the Citrus Margarita. I'm going to link everything. If it's not available, y'all probably can still find something that y'all like on the site. Um, it don't have the original pricing. Let me get the original price so y'all can see how much I paid. Because y'all need to see this. I saved a lot. I just know I did. Alright, let's see. Eloquy. This is where I usually sometimes cut it off so y'all won't have to wait too long. But I always say I think I got it, but let's see. <laughs> Maybe I'm probably like, you don't have it. I took my twist out, y'all. Now, I'm going, I'm vacationing so often, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to wear my hair for Nola. I was thinking two braids. I don't know how I'm going to wear it. Y'all know I like to have my natural hair out. I love my hair out like this, but traveling, and if you're getting in the pool and stuff, I mean, I could have it like this, but sometimes it don't look sexy with, like, sexy outfits. You want, like, a sexy dude. All right, y'all. I'm going to have to go to the LP side. I was trying to do it by Yahoo. I don't know if y'all hear that thunder, and I don't know if they have anything to do with my phone acting up because Direct TV is definitely acting up. Um, let's see. All right, I'm going to go because right now Eloquie is having um a warehouse sale, so everything is on sale right now, and their swimwear is definitely on sale. Today is, I don't know when y'all see this video, but today is August the 21st. Y'all might see this video the end of September. I'm sorry, but I have, I'm not working now, so uh, if I can, YouTube, when they start paying me again, this will be my full-time job. If I can get the subscribers that I need, because y'all know I got to get to 1,000 in order to get paid and 4,000 watch time and all this other stuff. But I know once I get to 1,000... I think all the other stuff I already have, I would just have to um, get monetized again. And I could start having them checks rolling in. And I would just have all, I have all the videos stacked up. And I'll just keep on pushing out more. And if that would be my dream to like have YouTube as my full time job, I love doing this. So that would be great. And maybe I can get sponsorships. I can start traveling, meeting different people. And just, um, uh, what you call it? networking? Yes. All right. So I found it. I found it. I found it. I found it. Okay. So ooh, y'all hear that? But yeah, that would be great. Y'all, it don't have the original price. So all this for nothing. So I'm going to say. Oh yes, it does. So the top for the uh, margarita citrus one, that the top is forty nine ninety five. That's how much it originally cost. It come in a mint color too. I'm gonna show you a mint color. It comes in this color too. And it's $49.95. I paid $19.97 for the top. Let me make sure. Yeah, I paid $19.97 for the top. And then the bottoms retail for $39.95. I paid $12.97. So that's a great deal. And then the pink one. I think that's the only color that this comes in. Um, it retails for $49.95 and I paid $19.97 and then the bottoms I'm sure is the same $39.95 and I paid let's see let's see let's see let's see I'm not really into one pieces at all I hated them when I did wear them it's because 
I hate getting naked in the bathroom when you're like swimming wet when you wet. I'd rather just take off my bottoms and pee or do what I gotta do. I hate to take off the full wet bathing suit. I and mean, sometimes you might have a cover up on, it's annoying. A bodysuit is totally different because you can snap it at um, between the legs, or I'm sure you might not have something over top of your bodysuit. So $39.95. They went back to the other one. Let's see. Um, $39.95 for the bottoms. And I paid $12.97. And I'm going to show you all the whole piece citrus one. And the, the bathing suit. The one piece that I did want to get. The one piece citrus is here. I was just going to get it. It's only $20. And it is cute. I should get it. That's how it look. Now I know how they run. That's how it looked. But I didn't want to go crazy on bathing suits with them. I might get it. It's too cute not to get it. But I already got the two-piece. That will make sense to get that. And I have the two-piece already. Right? Should I? Excuse me. I Shoot, I will wear it as a um, bodysuit. But they got ruffles at the bottom of it. That's what I think is cute. But the one I want to get is the popular one. Where is it at? This one. Everybody was on this one. I think it's so cute. And that one retails for $89.95 and it's $19.97 right now. I think I want this one. I think I'm going to get that one. Now that one I'll just be like, okay, I'll just deal with it. Alright y'all, so if y'all like this video, please like it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell so you'll know when all my videos are come out. Share this video so someone else can see. I tried LOP for the first time and see what they got to offer and how their sizing is doing. And how their size and look on a plus size body like mine. And um, leave me a comment. Let me know how y'all like this video and how y'all like my outfit. Um, my total for everything was $65.88. And I got free shipping. That's what I was happy because I had some kind of cold and they gave me free shipping. Um, yeah. Stay tuned for the try on. Till next time. Love you guys. Ciao. Bye, my fashion dolls. Bye, y'all. Okay, y'all, this is the margarita citrus one. What I'm not, it fit great. Um, I did hear a little stretching. Like, you know how you hear a little um, pulling when you put something on, but it fit great. The um, 18 is great. But what I don't like about it is, as I pull it up, this goes under. It's supposed to fit, it's a long line bikini top. So, I'm feeling it because it feels like, I don't know. I don't know if I snagged it. It's so like like the fruit is um like it's feel like it's material like it's it got a texture to it like it's textured. I don't know, but it's supposed to be a long line um bikini top. But when I pull it up and I need it pulled up, it's gonna sit like that. But I think that's because I don't have the straps on. So I'm gonna attempt to put the straps on like this while I have the bathing suit on. I don't think that's going to work out. Y'all know how I am with putting strips and stuff on. So I really don't think that's going to work out. But I think that's why it's not acting right because of that. I think that's why. Let's see. If I can find the back part to it. I <laughs> No, it's all the way back there, I think, y'all. I don't think I can do it on camera. So, I'm going to come back and show you. Okay, y'all, much better. It looks much better with straps. When you got some big jugs like these, you need straps. Um, I can crisscross it if I want to. I like it like this, but if I wanted it a little tight, I can crisscross it, without need, which I don't need. It's still rolling a little, and I think when I sit down, it's going to roll, but that's fine. Um, I prefer it up anyway, but it just seemed like it would be uncomfortable because... The bony, long as the bony is not folding, it's fine. If it roll up like this, is fine. But if that bony start rolling, it's gonna feel weird. But this is how it looks. So I don't think I gave y'all a full look. And this is how the back look. All right, on to the next one. I was gonna try the next one on with just the straps, but I promise y'all, I was just trying to show y'all how it look with the straps and all. Next one. Okay, y'all. I love this one. But I definitely cannot wear it like this. I feel like my boots is going to spill over. The class already came apart. 
but that was because when I was trying it on, it just came apart. But imagine if it's on and it just unsnapped and then spill it everywhere. But look what I discovered. Y'all know how I was showing y'all the bikini bottoms like this and the bow was right there, but the bow goes in the back. But y'all probably already knew that. But you see how I, I hate bikini tops that have a clasp like this because they never work out for me. I don't believe that these are fat girl friendly. I really don't think that bathing suits with one clasp like that is fat girl friendly. I mean, how is that going to work? Because all my swimsuits that I have with a one class like that, that goes in there, they never work out. Or maybe they're fat girl friendly, they're just not big boot friendly. I don't know. But no, because if you have a fat back, that's not going to work out. And I got a fat back, but my back not that fat. Look. Yo, look how it's going. Let's try it with the straps and see how it looks. And I think I'm going to turn my bathing suit bottom in the front to see how it looks with the bow in the front. And I'm in this plus size traveling group. So they had a little trick. They said if you want your bikini bottoms to fit high waisted in the front and have your booty cheeks out, turn the back to the front. Let's just see how it works. I'll be right back with the straps and the bathing suit bottom. Y'all, 20 minutes later. 20 minutes later. Let me tell y'all what happened. They made one of the... um. Baby suit loops, and I still got it twisted. No, I don't. Baby suit loops, um, the hole, they made it too small, whereas though I couldn't get the strap in, so it took me like 10 to 15 minutes to poke a hole and keep on twisting and twisting until the straps got it sucked, until I got one of the straps in. I believe it was the, it was the blue one, this one. I was having a hard time getting the strap in. So, it didn't help the back at all. It's still, well, it's not twisted right now, but it's still going to get twisted. So what I think I'm gonna do is try to get that part sewn shut. And this is rolling up because this strap is too tight, I believe. Let me try to loosen this strap up. I think that's why it's rolling up. But, wait. See, this is, I hate bathing suits when you got have difficulties. Cause when I start, when I put my swimmer on, I'll be ready to get right in the pool. Let me see, you see how it's rolling up? I do not like that. That's like a pet peeve of mine, rolling. I hate rolling. Oh, I'm gonna have to work with that. But the bottoms, the bow does belong in the front. Here go the tag right here. So y'all won't think I'm lying. <laughs> the I was right, the bow belong in the front. Um, it's the way I put them on. So when I put them on, the bow just flipped in the back and it made it seem like that it belong in the back. But it do belong in the front. I kind of like it in the back though. But it belong in the front. I didn't even have to switch them around. I just took them off and as I was taking them off the bow flipped over so I just took them off the bow flipped over and I was like so it do belong in the front and you can see that's how the lining is it goes like this but I guess the way I had it it just flipped in the back and I mean I could probably wear it either way because it looked cute in the back too so I probably could take pictures with it in the front and I probably could take pictures with it in the back and that's probably what I would do but this is the overall look to the baby suit once again this is how it looked Definitely going to shop Eloquy again. I'm going to see if I can get more swimwear and um, probably some dresses and stuff so y'all can just see what it looks like. But that's it, y'all.